Hey everyone and welcome to or back to my channel. So today I'm back with a super exciting video. Today I'm going to be doing a closet clean out and this is so needed. Like this is so overdue. My closet is literally such a mess. It is like ridiculous. If you guys have been keeping up with my channel, I've been posting a lot of clothing hauls recently. I've had the opportunity to work with some amazing brands that I love on some clothing hauls for the summer season. And with that, I've just received a ton of clothes. My closet is just overflowing. I literally just have piles of clothes everywhere and I've actually started to put clothes in my living room because I've run out of space in both my closet and my room. I have clean laundry that I physically can't put away because I don't have hangers and I don't have like physical space to put the clean clothes. It's just to the point where it's stressing me out and it's just a problem. It's an obvious problem. And today is the day that I'm just finally going to clean out my closet. It is something that just needs to be done. I feel like this has the potential to be the biggest closet clean out ever because I am just like in the mindset to get rid of things. A lot of times when I do closet clean outs, I just have like sentimental attachment to clothes and I'm just like in the mood where I'm like, I don't even care. I am not going to wear it. Somebody else could be enjoying it and wearing it while it's in style. It's taking up space, that's something I do like could be hanging there instead of being on the floor in my living room. I feel like I am in a really good mindset to do this. I'm just like sick of things I'm not wearing, taking up space. So I'm gonna be cleaning out my closet today. I am hoping that I can just like clean out my closet, reorganize my closet. I'm feeling super ambitious. Like I wanna clean out my drawers. I want to clean out the top of my closet. I have a bunch of bins and stuff that I haven't gone through in a long time. And I'm just really going to make the best of it. I've got my coffee. I just got an iced vanilla latte. I really hope that this is satisfying and helpful and inspiring if you guys are needing to clean out your closet as well. So definitely a thumbs up if you guys would like to see more closet clean outs. Definitely make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Turn on the notification bell. Follow me on Instagram at emilygrace.26. I am going to be selling pretty much everything that I am getting rid of on my Poshmark, which is emilygrace26. I'm gonna have it linked below in the description. So definitely check out my Poshmark I'm gonna try to have everything listed before this video goes up So like I said, I'm just gonna be making this whole entire process the most enjoyable it can be So I'm gonna be listening to some music with my Raycon earbuds. I actually talked about these in a previous cleaning vlog I really like these earbuds. I use them a lot whenever I'm cleaning or especially for summertime if I'm like laying out and tanning I love to just take my dog for a walk and if I'm like listening to music or something or editing videos or really just anything like that. So if you guys haven't heard of Raycon earbuds, they are disrupting the electronics industry by making great sound for everyone. The wireless earbuds start at half the price of other premium audio brands. Raycon offers their wireless earbuds in a variety of fun colors and patterns with a variety of fit options and there's no dangling wires or stems. And Raycon earbuds give you six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design for a comfortable noise isolating fit. And the company was actually co-founded by Ray J. Celebrities like Snoop Dogg and Mike Tyson are obsessed with Raycons. And Raycon also has a 45 day free return policy. So like I said, Raycon earbuds are perfect for laying out this summer or going on a walk or really just anything that you'll be doing this summer. Even just cleaning and decluttering, cleaning out your closet, they're perfect for that too. So definitely make sure to click the link in my description box or go to buyraycon.com slash emilygrace to get 15% off your Raycon purchase. Like I said, I'll have that in the description box. You should definitely check these out. They come in so many different colors. So here's what my Raycons look like. This is the little case they are just so discreet and they fit so comfortably in my ear they have a variety of fit options so they just fit so perfectly in my ear now that I've got my music and my coffee I'm just gonna get started on the closet clean out here is my closet starting out it's just very full like it's very very full I literally cannot see like if I wanted to see what this is like it's really hard for me to move the hangers enough to even see like what the shirt is. I also have a few skirts and dresses. I recently got a few new dresses, so this is a little more stuffed than normal. Also have this bin up here. It's kind of like opposite season bottom, so kind of like some more shorts, sleep shorts, lounge shorts. I could definitely be wearing them right now because they're all summer. Also kind of have swim and then some hats and accessories in here. I would love to kind of go through these. I also have a few more shorts up here. I think I'm gonna start with this bottom rack because this is like my main priority so I think I'm just going to literally carry sections out so I just brought a big section of my closet out here to kind of go through it and only put back in what I'm actually wearing and kind of think of it that way so I'm just gonna kind of sort through this it's kind of like my colorful tank tops and then kind of like my navy blue and striped top so I'm just gonna go through these 
and see what I can find to get rid of. I'm trying to ask myself have I worn this in the last year would I rebuy this if I was in a store and I'm also telling myself something that I'm not wearing and I'm holding on to it I'm going to value having the space in my closet and just like the peace of mind of having an organized closet I'm going to value that more than clothes that I'm not actually wearing I have these and these are kind of like kind of struggling like i feel like these are such classic brandy melville pieces and there was a time where i really really loved these can't remember the last time i wore these also i put my glasses on because i can't see the viewfinder to make sure like i'm in focus and everything there's really no reason to keep it if i'm not wearing it i guess those will go this i might get rid of i did wear this fairly recently but i've only worn it once since i've had it and i just feel like there's other things i would be more likely to wear but it is kind of cute with like some denim shorts. I'll put this in like my maybe pile. We can sort through it later. going through the bottom section of my closet so basically all of the colorful clothes this is everything that I'm getting rid of from that so now I'm gonna go through the top section of my closet I did a lot of that the other day so That is what I'm gonna go through now. I'll probably just kind of like flip through it quickly instead of bringing out each section. So I'm just moving on to this section of my closet. The bottom section is pretty much all done. I feel like I have so much more space now. I also organized it a little bit. I'm gonna move on to this section, which is just like all my neutral colors. It does have a decent amount of space, so it's not like super packed in. This is about as good as it gets, but I'm just gonna see if I can find a few more things to get rid of from when I went through it the other day because I kind of just did it pretty quick. So I'm just gonna kind of go through it one more time. I just have my Raycon earbuds, I'm just listening to some music and I feel like that is just making this go by so much faster. And also it has like a little button so you can start and stop the music.
here's my progress so far. So this is quite a few items. I feel like I have done a pretty good job so far. I still have a few more areas of my room and closet to go through. And these are all pretty much spring and summer items too. So now that this main part of my closet is done, I think I'm going to tackle the skirts and dresses. I just decided to bring all of those out here. I have this little skirt. I actually just recently picked this up from Boohoo and I think it's really cute. So I'm gonna keep this. And then I have this. This is a little bit tight. I might just give this to my sister. This I'm definitely gonna keep. This fits very well. Next up is this, which is my hat bin. There are just a lot of hats. A lot of hats. I've got beanies, bucket hats, baseball hats, all kinds of things. Definitely want this. This is a super cute bucket hat. Um, also really like this little Adidas one. This beret, I don't even think it's a beanie, it's like a beret. I don't see myself wearing it's like not really even warm. It's just kind of like a fashion beanie I don't think I wear this. I think this might be too small for my head. This one is like my favorite This is my go-to beanie this one this one from Princess Polly. So I'm keeping those. I don't see myself wearing this Is this cute or no? It's red and it has a guest symbol I don't know. Okay, next up is this swimsuit bin. I pretty much never go to the pool and I don't live near a beach, so I don't know why I have so many swimsuits. It's like a little one piece from Princess Polly, I think. This has the tags on it and it is from American Eagle. I feel like white is probably not my most favorite color for a swimsuit. It probably would be my like last pick. I might just go ahead and get rid of this since it has the tags on it and I've like, never worn it. I got this leopard one last year and I do not see myself wearing it. I don't know why I got it. Swimsuits are done. I did find some to get rid of. So next up is just kind of like some random stuff at the top of my closet. So I have this bin with some shorts and kind of like opposite season clothes. And then I also have all of these extra denim shorts. I'm just gonna kind of like sort through those. And I also need to kind of like switch out my drawers for the season. So in here I have a bunch of like really thick sweatpants and kind of like winter pajamas. I kind of like reorganize my dresser a little bit to fit some of my summer bottoms. And I'm just gonna put my Recon earbuds back in so I can listen to some music while I sort through all this because it's probably going to take me a while. I literally have no idea what all is in here. I feel like I'll probably find quite a few things to get rid of because it's looking like a lot of this stuff is things that aren't really wear. Okay, so a little update. I tried on a bunch of denim shorts, mainly the ones that I had in the closet. I'm getting rid of all of these and maybe even some more. I've gone up a size or so and also my style has changed. I've kind of hung on to them in the last year or so thinking I'll wear them and I haven't. So I'm getting rid of all of those. Now I'm just kind of reorganizing my drawers for the shorts that I am keeping. This is my shorts drawer. These are just some shorts that were already in here that I'm keeping. I have this drawer which I'm currently figuring out how to organize basically full of sweatpants and I just took them out. I should have shown you before, but I forgot and made space for all of my lounge shorts. I probably roll them up like these so I can see them better. Now back to the denim shorts. There we go, they are all kind of, there's not really even rolled, they're almost just like folded, but like sideways, but kind of worked. 
Um, I feel like this is a lot easier to like see them all and it's kind of like more aesthetic and it kind of matches up with those. So that's what I just did for the sweatshorts. So I think the last thing I'm gonna do is my jeans. They are definitely really stuffed. They are so overfilled that I actually have another pile to the side. I feel like my style and jean preference has definitely changed. One cubby hole of black jeans alone. I think that's pretty good. Okay, so I found all of these jeans to get rid of. It still looks really full, but the stack of jeans next to the next to this is gone. So I know this is like a ridiculous amount of jeans, but I did work at American Eagle for like seven years and yeah, you get like a really good discount and it's hard not to buy jeans all the time. Also do work with a lot of clothing brands, so I've accumulated a lot of jeans over the years. I'll kind of go through them again in the fall and winter and find more probably. Okay, so here is my final pile of everything I am getting rid of. I'll probably kind of sort through it one last time and just like double check everything. There's definitely a lot of denim. I didn't expect to really get rid of this much denim. I do have a lot of tops as well, just kind of like buried underneath. Okay, so I think that is everything for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely give it a big thumbs up if you did. I feel like I was actually so productive today and got rid of so much. Definitely check out my Poshmark. It's at Link Grace 266. I also have it linked below in the description box. Definitely make sure to check out Raycon. You can go to buyraycon.com slash Emily Grace. I'm going to have them linked below at the very top of my description box. I absolutely love them and they have definitely helped me out throughout this video. I feel like my closet is so much better than it was before. It's definitely less stuffed and I got rid of a lot of clothes and I feel like my drawers are so much more organized. I'm really glad I took the time to do that. That has literally been on my to-do list for like months now <laughs> and thank you guys for coming along. I probably wouldn't have been so productive if I wouldn't have filmed it. Comment below your best cleaning tip, especially when it comes to cleaning out your closet. And thank you so much for watching. Definitely make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Turn on the notification bell. Follow me on Instagram at emilygrace.26. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.